Can I balance you there? Is that going to work? I think it's going to work. I am sitting outside of Walmart. Big truck moving. Ooh, no, I, I don't have to pull up. I uh, could not go out yesterday. I wanted to come to Walmart to get some chopped steak. And I could tell it was raining. I could hear it. I don't look outside when I'm working. <laughs> and I, I was, you know, I opened my apartment door and I started walking out. And it was just a pure sheet of ice on everything. So I said, well, this isn't good. And it was still, uh, you know, it was coming down, freezing rain. So I couldn't go out. And then today, my car was covered with, I would say, at least a half inch of ice, if not more. So I let it run for 20 minutes with my heat up and the rear defrost. But I have no scraper because I didn't know I'd need one of those. But you know what works? Where is it? Spatula. <laughs> That's what I used. For just ice like that, I knew that if I heated my car, that ice would just come off in big sheets once it got warm enough. And uh, that's pretty much what happened. You know, I broke it up a little bit and yeah, so that was fun. And now I just went to the post office to deliver packages and I ran here to Walmart, but I asked Derek first if he needed anything. I stopped at his apartment because last night he came out in that mess because he needed printer ink for his, his printer at the apartment and uh, a, he forced himself to go out to get it because he really needed it but everything was closed, Walmart was closed and today there's not that many people out and about because they probably don't feel like cleaning off their cars. So I stopped by, he said no, he went this morning and got what he needed and um, he said he would like some soup, so I'm going to make some soup for him when I get back. I have all the soup stuff in the freezer, and uh, so I will do that for him today, and I'll probably walk it down to him. It's not slippery outside. Yesterday I had to dance for my exercise because I could not walk outside. It was, it was just, it was bad. I uh, am busy with other things too today. Anxious to get started on my two inch square king size quilt top. I wanted to start last night but I ended up with an upset tummy and I was confused as to why and I know this might sound weird but I think I can't digest unsalted butter because there was a time I was making ghee which I finally gave up on. I was trying to make it the way I liked it and I couldn't recreate it and then I gave up and then I tried again, I made it, but it's not consistent and I don't feel like babysitting a fucking little pot of melting butter. You know? So I just don't uh, do that now. But I used to mix salted with unsalted because the ghee was tasting very salty with just the salted and uh, so... I was eating that and then I, I was really sick one night. I was like, what the hell is going on? And I stopped eating the ghee because I thought it's just too rich for me. And I went back to eating just butter. If you don't know why I'm talking like this, it's because I'm doing high fat carnivore uh, until the end of June of this year, 2023. So um, I you know, I felt better right after that. And then uh, yesterday I said, geez, I have unsalted, so I better use some of that up. And I had unsalted and I, I was sick last night. I mean, I just felt really like sick, like I didn't digest. I wanted some antacids. Oh, fuck, I forgot. I don't, I don't want to go back in. It was one of the reasons I was coming here because I didn't have any, but I won't be sick tonight because I'm back to just salted butter. <laughs> What a boring story. I just wanted to let you guys know that we had what they're calling an ice storm. It's just, it just ice, and it was a pain in the ass to clean off the car. But people did a good job. I, you know, the thing I worry about is the people who leave that big sheet of ice on the top of the car because that will fucking fly off and hit you right in the windshield if you're behind them. So I'm just careful with who I get behind and I keep my distance. I guess that's going to be it. I did not intend on doing a car vlog at all. Am I even recording? Oh my god, I always worry about that. 
and uh, 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 I guess that's it. So go watch my king size quilt top with two inch squares only. Go watch that video so you can see what I'm about to um, do which I plan on having it be a, a long time, but I'm not going to bombard people with videos about that series. But I will do another one, um, you know, with some kind of a time estimate. I mean, it could be months because it's, it's a lot of two-inch squares sewing together. 4,624 two-inch squares. But I'm going to enjoy it. I, I really think I am. I hope, I hope I do. That's enough. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.